like when you watch the movie, you see all the all the costumes and the special effects and everything that that goes into it. How does how much is it actually the like the costume department and how much of it is sort of and and obviously don't say what you can't say. I know like you have NDAs and, and the rest, but how like how does that work? The amount of like costumes and makeup that goes into it and then like the special effects that you see. How does that work? Does it like does it seem weird on set when you're like, why is that person in like that crazy costume? Like not within the setting. Does it seem weird or like how does all that work? Um so basically how the how the um uh, set is set up, they'll have like green screens. They have little X's and all kinds of things of that sort. And you're just looking around and you're like, I really wonder how all this is gonna gonna look once all the editing and final production is done it's just really interesting it looks like a lot simpler than what you see with the final product Mm -hmm. um with regards to people in their costumes and everything um i know vision was on the set i didn't get to see him but i know he was on the set when i was there so i didn't get to see him in his full suit and everything but people were telling me that he was full costume and everything so it looked just like how he looks on the screen um but yeah um just walking around seeing people seeing uh because even on the falcon and winter soldier set i didn't really uh, see anthony mackie in his falcon costume or the guy who plays bucky in his uh winter soldier costume or anything of that sort they were just mainly wearing like regular clothes going around the scene with regular clothes or um, it was regular clothes when they're in the town and when they were in the club scene of course they have the club and their clothes on mm-hmm. um, but yeah um, yeah basically uh, just walking around seeing them and uh, just their get up and everything just with their costumes and everything it was it was pretty. It was just a cool experience, man. That's that's the that's the only thing I can really say about it. It's just a really cool experience. It's cool to see how everything comes to life. The the movie magic, as they call it, mm-hmm. um, when, when they're done with post production and everything. Because again, when you're on set, you see everything. You're just like, wow, they're really gonna take this and make this into like something like incredible, something. And it's it's. Like shout out to all the uh, directors, writers, producers, uh, people in the editing room, because like you see how everything is on set, and you see their just their creative minds with post production and just how how they edit everything. It's just like wow, like you really made this happen out of this set. Like, yeah. It, it, like like you you see. Like when you're on set, like a, a field or something of that sort, and then you see it when you actually watch the show, and you're just like, wow, they really made this field like expand a lot. They really make this area look totally different than how it looked on set. Um, while I was on one of the uh, one of the film locations, um, you know, we see this land. And as we were driving by it, they were telling us, they were like, yeah, over there, that's, that's Wakanda over there. I was just like, really? I was just like, that right there, that's Wakanda? It was just like a, a whole, just like regular old grass field. But when you really look at it, you're just like, oh, wow, that really is Wakanda. Like, you really look at it and, you know, you, you see the uh, battles that they had on the field and mm-hmm. uh, things of that sort. So it's just like, wow. It's just incredible what they're able to do with, um, you know, the film locations and the sets and how everything is set up. Just the movie magic there would be great. Yeah, you hear so much about movie magic when you watch interviews or or something like that. Can you?